Yesterday's video with the GeForce Now Ultimate Tier Update was filled with many improvements, including hardware updates, which will in turn lead up to 240 FPS, 240 Hertz gaming. Now this is great. I love hardware improvements since they are needed to run games like Cyberpunk and Darktide effectively at 4K. Here's my problem. How many GeForce Now users actually have the requirements to run games at 240 Hertz? My monitor maxes out at 144 Hertz. One viewer really hits this on the nose. This won't benefit those who don't have a 4K 120Hz monitor. Now there are several monitors out there that support 240Hz, but check out this monitor for $200 that's on sale. And yes, this is a budget 240Hz monitor. This is one of the few. And don't get me started on the 4K monitors. I bought this one especially for the channel to go above 120Hz. This thing was $800 last year. Jesus Christ. Maybe I should have waited. Now ultra wide monitors aren't cheap either, especially at 120 hertz. <laughs> These guys got jokes. Now on top of the price for a 120 hertz 4K monitor, streaming in 4K still requires a GPU at least of the Pascal generation. That's right. This means you need a GPU at least from the GTX 1000 series or higher. Hello eBay, this is even more of a cost to you. Now 240Hz phones are coming out but there are just a few of them. And on top of this, they're flipping expensive. And for tablets, they're basically non-existent. Now let's not forget the internet requirements to stream 240Hz. A minimum of 35 megabits per second. Now let's be real, how far have you gotten with the minimum requirements? Yeah, this already rules out a bunch of people. We'll have to test this, but recommended stable video is probably somewhere in the 50s. And as this user stated again, we had a Ferrari, but now they're giving us a Bugatti, but we're stuck on dirt roads with no fuel stations. They need to invest in interstate construction. I couldn't have said it better myself. With all these stipulations and cost, I'd rather them focus on servers in odd places so people can get lower latency, especially for the free tier. This would be extremely beneficial for mobile users. Just saying. Make no mistake, I love these upgrades, but these selling points are byproducts of just upgrading to RTX 40 caliber hardware. I don't think the majority will use the 240Hz functionality. Heck, I don't even know how many got to 120Hz on GeForce Now. I think I'll poll this to see how many used it. And to be honest, I don't even think the majority of GeForce Now users have the internet download speed to stream that high, especially those outside of the US. Let me know your thoughts below. If you like my opinion on the new GeForce Now Ultimate tier, give us a like. Also, make sure to join as a member of the channel or join our Patreon in the links below. And above all else, make sure to subscribe to keep it locked right here at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle. This is the Black Knight. I'm off to the store to get my 240Hz monitor.